Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler, and welcome back to RimWorld. Just watching Natalia here, I've got her uh, tricked into hauling steel by having her lay out all of the conduits over here, although she tends to uh, lay out everything but what I've asked her to do. <laughs> oh, you want, you want metal over here? Okay, let me build this tool cabinet over here. Oh, you want metal over there? Okay, let me put the light in over here. So, <laughs> She's actually doing it this time. Well, she got a little bit of it done. <laughs> anyway, so worked them pretty good through the night. Got lots of miscellaneous stuff done. And I sent everybody over this way and this way and brought in steel. Though to trick some of them to do it, I had to have them build uh, tool cabinets and things. So we're going to find some steel just kind of hanging out over here where I then broke them down and reset them so that we just get the steel available. Alicia, what you doing? You are digging at limestone, which we are almost done. Where are you going? Digging at limestone. Oh, found a little deposit of something over here. Okay. And I found a deposit over in here, too, that I was staring at. I've been staring at for the last uh, several episodes, and I finally decided to go over here and say, what is that? So that's compacted steel, so I broken from the the back side over here and let uh, Mississippi work at it a little bit last night um, so I've run I think through the night since last episode got some mushrooms sprouting over here glow stool is that the same thing wait a minute here glow stool non ideal temperature because it's too warm or too cold um, first of all a small ground mushroom typically found in caves it smells like an old dirty rag pulled over the stomach of a rotten muffalo <laughs> pulled out of the stomach of a, of a rotting muffalo but it tastes surprisingly good when cooked dies when exposed to light I was trying to find mushrooms or raw mushrooms or anything like that and I didn't find it but I didn't look for the word glow there's nothing like that in here right no, there's not. Okay. I was going to say, we haven't seen any mushrooms. But, uh, you, you did stay where you're supposed to be, right? You are select a plant to grow? Well, that is interesting. I've never seen that graphic before. Doesn't it normally start with potato? This is strawberry, so I'll go to strawberry, but... Wow. That felt different. Anyway, um, I've not seen any mushrooms grow back in all of our dark, dirty areas on the map. Except for a couple of the... Oh, oh, there's a second one. Okay, where's the big one I'm thinking about? Right there. We've got a couple of these growing. These Agarilux. But that is now the second one that I've seen since we picked everything at the very beginning. So another round of glow stools. Okay. Anyway, Klaus and Rabbit, I've sent to go and collect a bunch of these. Everyone else is getting up, except for Handy and Cather. I think I worked them the latest last night. So, Michael is working on Kibble. And, actually, when you're done with that, how about you could bring over some more wood over here. Of course, after you eat, so I'll do it that way. And, wood's up here. Okay, speaking of wood, we set this pile over here out in the rain. How, do you, how about we uh, get that one built and get a roof over that? So, Handy, when you're done, pop over here and... Well, I'll wait. I want you to grab a meal. So, who else is around here that can construct? Tangria's over there. 11 o'clock hour. Handy must have her meal because she is leaving. Okay, so pop over here and build this one. And do I... I thought about setting the roof. Did I? I did not. So, if we do this now I'm assuming she won't build it before caribou are coming through before um, she puts the roof over the top wow she's fast caribou are coming through I was going to say did I build the roof or not I don't know and then I realized as I was about to start this episode that what I thought was the save file turned out to not have some of the things that I did so apparently I didn't save the last part of it I do want to talk about this in a moment, but, um, so I might be having some pretty serious, uh, deja vu moments here, thinking I did that, but I didn't because I did do it, but it didn't save. Anyway, um, Tony was, was talking about Klaus's room right here, the, uh, um, the warden's quarters, 
in that if he and Sangria do uh, marry, let's see, Klaus, how you doing on your social? Still only 57, so not super thrilled for some reason, or they just never seem to cross paths. That's probably more like it. But, um, you know, maybe they should have a room that's more in between the two somehow, which makes sense. You know the barn and and the and the the jail, but I got to thinking after reading that and staring at this a while. The way that I always built my underground bases before, and that was before I became Noble Rambler. So I played RimWorld a lot through the early alphas, and then I, the next time I played it was Alpha Twelve, which I recorded for the channel, which got interrupted by Alpha Thirteen. So I recorded that one, and I hadn't played RimWorld um, at all during that because I found that when I play a game and then I record a game I'm always mixing up what I have done with one or the other so I've learned just to stay with one game only so that took close to a year to do that series and since then I've just haven't had time to play games for myself anymore so I haven't played RimWorld really since about Alpha 12 as far as playing it daily and really enjoying it so back then I always made sure to have a doctor's quarters with the hospital and a warden's quarters with the prison but since then they have added jail breaks and I got to think and staring at this who gets to be the front line of defense against however many prisoners are in here because when they break they tend to all leave at once it's magically all the doors open up and I don't think Klaus could handle it so I don't think I really want his bedroom right here anymore that just won't work so i guess klaus and and sangria or just klaus is going to you know are going to be somewhere out in here and just have to go he's going to have to drive to work every day yeah whereas tomislav it seems really fitting at least the prisoners or the uh, the patients won't revolt but it does seem fitting to be able to go around and feed everybody and and you know give them their their medicines and whatever is necessary that seems really thematically correct over there but the warden's quarters probably isn't going to work now that RimWorld has jailbreaks and as fast as I think it was was a Sangria or Cathra whoever was in this room and they broke out and the other one went and meleeed meleeed them and took them down I want to say that was Cathra but I'm not sure now I think it was um, she broke out of there for no reason at all. It wasn't a bad mood. It wasn't mistreatment. It wasn't. It was a pretty nasty-looking place at the time. But uh, I was surprised how easy it was. How how quickly it happened. Which means the odds. Either we just rolled, you know, a random number generator, and it just really went against us at that moment. But anyway, we've got a caribou who heard going on, which I pause all this time because I'm trying to decide if we want to deal with this. Um, large herd passing through. Jump to where are you at? Ooh, you're actually coming down low and near us. Okay. I wasn't wanting to do that right now, but if you guys come south, you're not. You're going north. You're starting here. You're going south. Well, we could take out this group right here. We don't need the, the mass slaughter, but believe it or not, we still need a lot of meat. We're down to 700 and some meat, whereas we've got over 3,000 vegetables, and our meals are evenly you know, produce out of meat and vegetables, so we are behind by quite a bit of meat. Hmm. Caribou run at what? I'm afraid to ask. Um, you are running at 4.8. Ouch. You are running at 4.8, so whatever ground you happen to be on, you are running at 4.8. We run at 4.4 to 4.7. We're going to be run down. Um, if they charge us. So that's if they they revenge on us. Um, Rabbit, you are equipped with a pistol right now. Hmm. Klaus, you are halfway over. Klaus, you've still got the assault rifle. Rabbit, how about... I'm assuming the assault rifle got brought to the armory. Let's see here. It would be here. No, those are snipers. I thought I had one set up for assaults. I don't. So the assault rifle that... Natalia just made. Did somebody equip it? Like, handy. No, she's got a charge. Let's think about this here. Sniper, sniper. We've got a minigun and we've got an, an incendiary. Got another sniper. Got a, a bolt action rifle. We've got a charge. So what's down in here? There we go. There's an assault rifle. So handy, you are up here right now. 
Heading... Oh, you already built that. Hadn't he come and equip this real quick? I think we'll go take down some of them. Um, I'm lost. Here I am. Right there. Equip this one. And then... I've got to wait for you to do that. Although I can draft you and then tell you to equip. And I can still steer you after that. Yeah. Come do that. And then... Because you've got a charge right now. Uh, distance of 22. These guys are going to come down, but they may go right back up. Where to send you? Well, after that, at least hop out in this direction. We'll figure it out after that. Rabbit, what to do with you? I don't want a sniper on you. Who all has the... Michael's got. Michael would be up. He's hauling wood to... Oh, I sent him down there. to He sent him to, to do this. So you're right here right now. Okay, and you've already brought the wood. Let's drop the wood right there. That's, well, some pig's going to haul it away, isn't it? <laughs> oh, well, that's fine. Let's get moving. Um, run out over here. Let's figure out what's going to happen. Um, Klaus, you have got an assault rifle. Hmm, hop up in here, too. We'll just, just dump the, the steel in the river. I'm sure it'll be fine. Draft and head up into here here as well, which is going to take you out that way. Handy, now, Tomislav, you've got a pistol, but you're up here, or a, a revolver. You're up here already. We could put a sniper on you. Actually, bolt action. Let's, let's look at the difference. So, bolt action, poor 68%. That's not too good. So, I would imagine that will skew these numbers. Accuracy is in the 70s. Range is 37. And... Warm up and cool down of 1.9 and 126. So how does that compare to sniper normal 99%? So more range, which is good since they can run so fast. The warm up is a whole four seconds. Wow. Okay, that's not going to do. So Tomasov, you are relaxing socially. Let's get this guy equipped and actually draft equip and you're gonna be the first one here get out to here and let's see which direction they're gonna take otherwise sangria pistol klaus shantigo pistol kathra basically pistols michael's on his way and miss a p pistol alicia pistol let's go with the four for now the four assault rifles all right, let's, let me get out and watch this so I can see it happen. Handy's heading that way. Um, Michael, Tomislav, Klaus, Rabbit. So the five, I got Michael, right? Michael's there. So it's five heading that direction now. No, Rabbit has not been tagged. Okay. He's a good shot, though. Hmm. Hmm. What to do with him? Get up here anyway. We'll figure that out. If we go north, I can stick Rabbit into the uh, the safe room over here if we have to. While the other ones get... Yeah, we'll see. What's with this group, though? And where are they going? They're hugging the wall like they're going to go north rather than go across. I was hoping they would go through this. They might. They stopped going north. Okay, who's out here? Tomislav? Um, let's make our stand up in here. Rabbit? up in here as well. Klaus, head this way. Michael, head up this way. And Handy, you have made it to where? Right there. You're heading up this way too. Alright, you guys are moving through there. The long wait. Alright. Is there another tactic to use here? I don't want to get too far away from our gauntlet if we have to make a run. I don't think we're going to get into here. We have a lot of deer on the map still. We'll do more hunting in another episode. But let's go ahead and take this, this small group out here, assuming that they continue east. Looks like they will. Looks like they're headed for here. I hope so. That means they're going to come out of here. Um, Rabbit has the smallest range. You're right there. And that's going to have to stay that way. Okay, you guys hop in like that. You guys as a group hop in right there. 
I think that's pretty well laid out. You're going south. You're going to... Uh, what you guys going to do? These guys are going to hug that upper edge, and I can't do much about that. You're going up through. Okay. So you're going to come out here, I am guessing. Along with that pig, is probably going to take some uh, friendly fire there. Well, not friendly, but... Uh, anyway. Um, I guess as a group... Ah, I don't have the fire at button. Okay. Why is that? Is it because they're not all in range? Maybe. Now, can I hold down shift and click rabbit? I can. I still don't get it. All right. Well, as they come out through here, let's... We've struck compacted machinery. Let's fire at them. And rabbit, your range is almost there. Almost. Okay. Then, as a group, let's move in a little bit closer. And, boy, they scattered. <laughs> um, boy, let's go a little bit closer. Don't mind the, uh, the steam geyser. It won't, uh, it won't hurt. <laughs> so, all but Rabbit. Right there. Try that again. Rabbit, your range is just not there yet. Yep. Thomas Love. Nope, don't fire at Thomas Love. <laughs> okay, we all canceled that order, right? No, somebody didn't. Alright. Um, everybody, break. And draft again. Don't, oh, be shot, Thomas Love. <laughs> I'm guessing that was Rabbit. He's the only one that could have fired that quickly. Thomas Love, how you doing? Gunshot to the torso. <sighs> How many times in this series has he been shot? <laughs> and he's got a helmet and uh, armor on now. <laughs> okay, Thomas Love. Let's go back with the group. Otherwise, you guys are heading that way. Oh, man. Okay, um, Rabbit, let's single you out right there and get you over to here. The other ones, let's go north. Rabbit, shoot out. Out of range. Rabbit, go up here. And shoot out. Okay. You guys, can you still hit him? Okay. That's good. Let's go further north. I'm gonna catch these guys in here. Okay. Let's. He's out of range now. Oops. Don't do that. Just fire at. Boy, if these guys rampage now, we're we're going to be in a world of hurt. Take him out. No. Okay, yeah. yeah. Rabbit head up further. Good. Took him down. Rabbit fire at. You guys fire at. Caribou revenge. Alright, here it is. Um, you are after Tomislav, as if he hasn't had enough. <laughs> Tomislav, run south. <laughs> and the rest of you just keep shooting. Okay, you guys, shoot out. Alright, we're good. Whew! Okay, that's all we're going after. Let's break you guys. Let's... Everybody, you are downed. So all that are downed, hunt. Tomislav, you get this one. And Rabbit, you can take that one. Michael, yours is this one. Klaus, yours is that one. And Handy, with the fastest run speed, you can take the furthest one. One for each works out really well. This one took some bullets. Health. Um, bleeds out in 14 hours, and let's see, what am I looking at here? Run speed. You're at 3.87. Do I send somebody after you? I think I do. Handy, you go after this one. Hunt. Wolf. Right there. Needs. Are a little iffy. But we can try it. I think so. Um, 
tempted to have all of us go after the wolf really quick before we leave here. Tomislav, how you doing? Can you make this? Uh, 4.48, your run speed is still fine. And health, you're in no immediate danger. I think you're fine. Let's all of us go up here. Like so. Uh, draft, head up top. We'll come back and hunt them in a moment. But I want to do two things. I think we want to take the wolf down. Though we're awfully close to it. Let's go over here. Well, no, let's go here. i got to get close to this guy before he leaves the map. Eh, I may not have a choice. I may not have a choice. Okay, then come on over here. Uh, get rid of that one. And if we all took it out at once, will we take it down? This is where, on my own, I would hit save. <laughs> Alright, make these shots count, guys. That did it. Okay. So, unforbid you, and is it still possible for Handy to get in there? Probably not, and if it revenges, all of them come at us. So, that's not going to happen. So, let me reset these orders one more time. Uh, guys, come on down here. Make this a lot easier on me. And somebody's going to head up here. In fact, let's quickly set a pig to come up here right now. Wild boar area. Let's shoot right up into there and encompass that little zone right there. Okay. So a pig will get it, if not somebody who is set to butchering. So Michael, why don't you uh, undraft? Okay, Michael, you can hunt. Handy, you can hunt. Tomislav, you can hunt. Rabbit, take this one. And Klaus, take this one. And Rabbit, what are you doing? He got up again? Okay, time out, everybody. Okay, thank you. Now let's reset everyone again. Rescue. Um, hunt. Hunt. There we go. Nope, he hasn't reset yet. So there. There. And Klaus, there it is. Now we got hunt. All right, that takes care of all those. They're gonna haul them all in, and we can go back to what we're doing down here, which is what. Alicia's grabbing the compact machinery over here. Good. Um, stay long enough to see if this needs to be uh, queued up or not. There we go. Does not. So cancel you and cancel you. All right, that takes care of that little vein. Um. Did I do anything else through the night? I don't think so. Mostly just hauled steel in and then spread it out amongst some of the conduits. I want to get lights operating in here while we're doing the rest of our construction. And that's about all that I got done. So it didn't really advance the game very far. Yeah. And when the pigs are running to the west, it makes them look like they're, they've got this funky hairdo. But he won't do it for me now. Everyone, I want to show it off. <laughs> Alright, so I wonder if that is our raid. That was our event for a while. Hmm. Let's set some walls up in here. This does need to get done soon. It could be marble. We've got the granite exterior. Let's put a marble interior into here. It's not as strong, but still, you know, something is better than nothing. We could put a third one, too, and make this, uh, you know, for certain that no one's going to want to uh, bust into this. Hmm. Not right now, though. I'll be fine. So, lay that out. Still want somebody to... Yep, yeah, they... Somebody hold my wood away. Still want somebody to get in there and finish building that, just so that it's done. Um, otherwise, what's going on? Tomasov needs to head into a... He is. So, Natalia is sleeping. Come on over here and tend to Tomasov, who is set for blue medicine good and cleaning in here let's check that out out of curiosity we're in good shape except for the door all right so in that case Kathra hop in here and clean that one real quick since you're in a cleaning mode perfect which means you must have enough uh, blocks to to get by right now 
So how good a job is Natalia going to do? 86% quality. Good. That's all done, and she is hauling unfinished steel advanced helmet. Okay, she's going to work on her stuff because I woke her up. And she's not tired enough to go back to bed. Tomislav, health, you're in good shape. 36 out of 40, so 4 ticks and you're healed. And your meal, that's what I was looking at. Your food will be fine by then. Okay, that's all done. Handy, you are down here probably going to put all the power conduit in that uh, Natalia, both of you are going to get everything built that's got materials brought to it. Good. Then what? Uh, since Klaus can do that, Handy, why don't you concentrate on the next set of beds? Um, what are you doing, Klaus? Building wooden bed. That's what I thought. So, Handy, you're going to do that instead. And then you're going to... There it is. Do this one and this one. And your food is... I think fine enough to handle one more. So after that, come and do this one and this one. And we'll see if that works. Klaus, you're going to assemble all these little things in a wall. Um, if we've got enough blocks to where we're not cutting anymore, then who can haul just blocks around for me? Handy rabbit is... Klaus failed to construct a marble block wall? Really? Wow. He's got a pretty good construction skill, too. So, Rabbit is harvesting hay grass in the rain. Any more harvested stuff up here I need to worry about? Nope. So, before you leave, I need to get back up there, 20 hundred, and have you haul it back down. Sangria, what are you up to? You are training wild boar. I think we have enough wild boar training that's been done for a while. Why don't you bring over... What? Um, bring over all of the marble blocks to here right there, and then bring over the random marble blocks for this area, and then bring over some granite blocks there, and there, and granite uh, there, and there. They're all nearby. These should be fast little trips. Then they'll be in place for uh, Klaus and Sangre to build, or uh, Klaus and Handy to build tomorrow. Okay, Michael, you are relaxing socially. Um, two hours, one hour left. Is there anything more I can get you to do? Needs? No, nope, you need it, so I'm going to leave you alone. Natalia is making incendiary shell, so we must have found 50, 60, 70 chem fuel. Okay, so yeah, we'll get. I think I've got a queued to 20 shells. Once we have 20 in here, then we're good for hopefully the rest of the game. We could tone this down a bit to get other things done. Yeah, we could. Let's see, what have I got here? I'm down to 10 on these guys. Okay, so let's take you down to 10 as well. We'll go that route. So, 10 and 10. And then after we've done more of the sewing and other projects around, we'll, we'll advance that again. Okay, so with that, I'm still looking for someone to haul supplies. Shantigo, what have you been up to? You are butchering Okay, um, how tired are you? Your food is in trouble. Okay, and I remember we used to have the meat all piled out here outside the butcher table. I stared at that one day while I was editing. I thought, why are we doing that? So I set them back to, you know, take to the best stockpile instead of drop on floor, and that problem went away. I still don't know why I thought that was important, but at the moment I did but there's probably no way of getting Klaus to haul that last caribou in or not Klaus but Chantigo um, with all of those to butcher over there not caribou it was there was a wolf over here yeah he's gone okay um, Chantigo what kind of meat are you hauling you're hauling in wolf meat somebody got the order I wonder if he got the order while it was downed, but before these guys brought the other ones in. That's possible. That must be what happened. Um, so that kind of wandered through everybody, right? Kathra, no, I didn't see you. Cleaning dirt. I could get you to do a little bit of, of work before we shut down. You are marble blocks. Yeah. So Kathra, marble blocks are four. So four into 75. 
five. That's a little less than 20. 19. So like three rows. If I get you to do two groups of each. Okay. So Cathra, if you came out here and did this one, and then this one, and that one, and that one, that should fill most of those in. Though if you're this close and can do it this quick, I'll have you also do this one, because that will take up another pile of those. Okay, with all that, the two of you will be here making blocks all, time, all day tomorrow. Klaus, you are construction failed. I'm going to have to get you some sleep or something, because you're, you're not doing too good right now, are you? Any other easier construction to do? <laughs> um, how about you put these in before uh, the night's over? Alright, let's do that instead. Yeah. Okay, so I think that's about all that we're going to accomplish this day. They're about done. Um, somebody, though, Tomasov's fully healed. Great. I bet you got a good rest, too. Tomasov, you were there. Where are you at right now? You are right there, just blending into your background. You're going to grab some food. Your rest is great. After you, after you food up, why don't you take care of refueling that for me? And what else would be wonderful if you did it? Um, hmm. Deconstruction. Our water is gone. So I set these guys. That's one thing. That's one order that did remain on this save game. Um, let's tear this one down. Let's get all the deconstructing done around the map. That one. You're to be deconstructed. Why? Why are you set there? Got to think about that. Oh, vents. I forgot to put in vents in these doors over here. So I have to go back and manually do that. So yeah, those need to go away. And then there's deconstruction up here that's been sitting for a long time. So take these out for me. Good. And I can run the game now because you're going to... I'm way ahead of you. Uh, it would be nice to get people to start bringing... Uh, blocks up to those walls. That's all the deconstruction. No, there's three more. Two more over here. Alright. So once all those are done, I can go back and set more things in. But we're going to need so much steel. We really are. Thousands and thousands. So, speaking of, Alicia's going to bed. Yep, she's in good shape. Miss a P, you brought your meal? You did. You'll be working here all night long, and you'll get all this finished. When you're done, what's next? There's nothing over there. Next is probably over here, as far as distance, and I've got them all queued up. And then maybe we'll get some gold in here if we, if uh, if you get out there before I, I I catch you and send you back up over here somewhere. We could do these, but they're not critical. Oh, that's right. Rabbo was going after Haygrass. Um, he was heading here, and looks like it got hauled in. Good. So maybe our hauling orders have run out. I've set all these to no longer replant. That's why we're not reseeding them or re, you know, sowing them. Because we're basically at the end of our, of our growing season. Another two days and it's done. So there's no point spending the time if you could instead spend the time uh, harvesting more. So I told it not to restart. Although this looks like it's just been done. Nope. Done enough back that... Hmm, do we want to roof this section? Possibly. We have a lot of animals now. We're going to need a lot of hay grass. Huh, we really are. Okay. Um, who's up still? And why are you up? Sangria, I had you hauling things and now you're constructing. Let's clear that so you can go to bed. Consuming a fine meal and then you'll go to bed. Okay, that's fine. Just wanted you to bring this stuff over. And Kathra is consuming a fine meal, and she no longer has orders. Actually, oh, and you're consuming a fine meal right here, too. Okay, so the two of you are going to go grab a, a very dark, gloomy table and, and have a meal together. Okay, Kathra, your needs, your rest is not that bad, and Sangris was not either. Okay, then Kathra, you afterwards can bring marble tile. Sangria can bring marble tile and marble tile. And... Kathra, you can bring um, granite blocks right there. And that should just about wipe you two out as far as uh, as sleep. Tomasov's doing all the deconstruction. Who else is up that I can 
I can ruin your, your plans. Relaxing socially over here. Natalia kind of needs it, so we'll leave that alone. And she'll probably be making a helmet or something afterwards, so I'll leave her alone. Mississippi's busy mining the steel that we need, so they're all queued up. So let's think about this. This is a 11 by 11, right? Inside dimensions, 11. Okay, so 12, 13. Exactly where do we do this? I want to leave this pathway here. I want the ah, uh, I want this guy to be able to shoot up into here. So what do we have down here then? If I were to grab an area like this, I don't know if I can fit it in here and still have a, a turret to uh, run in there. But it's already planted and it's growing and it's not going to get done in time. Uh, grow rate zero, ninety four percent grown. It will get done in time. Okay, let's not worry about that then. We probably need another greenhouse just for hay grass. This winter but I don't know that that is the spot it might be this spot here we're not running I thought we were I thought I hit the unpause um I think this is the spot really we'll get a geothermal to run it I think this is the wiser area so let's let's just get that in I would like to do it something other than wood but I don't think I'm gonna go there so with that wondering when it's time to roof this back over again hmm no, not yet. But you are there. Let me look at it without that. That is the exact... Okay. So if I were to set you there so that we have the overlap, I do that, then wood needs to be two spaces to the right of the current growth zone. All right, so you're going to go there. Just park you there. But we won't build you yet. Then I want wood, walls, structure, wood, to go... If I do this, we're going to kill our grow zone. So eventually it's going to be here. It's going to go up like so, and come across. This will we'll bust this out, everything but that center uh, granite column right there, the wall that got left over. I'll wait for another day or two before disturbing the, uh, the grow zone. And then we will want a door here and here, and probably one up in here. Hmm. Something more like that. That looks pretty consistent. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Something like that. Which means another one will drop into this area. Okay. So that'll kind of happen. They can build this. There will be no power going to it. Then we'll conduit from there to there. The one heater will be enough, unless we uh, uh, have some kind of a, uh, uh, a cold snap or something. All right, so that's plans laid out for there. Otherwise, how you guys doing? Uh, construction's going on. Don't need you build anything. Just needed you hauling it. You need to go to bed. And Sangria went to bed. Okay, Tomislav's doing fine. Needs, yeah, he's all messed up. He's going to be uh, a while before he uh, gets his schedule back to normal again. But you're at the end of your orders. So what is there for you to do? I could have you bring over the wood for here. In fact, let's send you more to here. You done? You're done. So there, and then there, and then something in between. About there. Wild boar is given birth. That is number 21, 22, and 20. 22 wild boars now. Wow. Well, we can fit 19 right in here, so we're still okay on space. Um, Food-wise, yeah, we got a ways to go. Hmm. Okay. So now what? About 40 minutes or so into this. No excitement. No raids. I am on history. Cassandra Ruff. Yep. Normally Cassandra Ruff is a lot rougher than this. I wonder if they've changed that at all in Beta 18. Changed what, uh, you know, I, does Cassandra Ruff from Alpha 13 uh, remain consistent to this version? 
Do we need to kick this up a notch? I don't necessarily need more severe raids. Now, I do have the, the goal of keeping everybody alive through the, the whole length of the series, but I would like to have more opportunities to bring more people into this series. That's really my what I'm thinking about right now. We've cleaned a lot of this out. Yeah. But um, let me just kind of stare at all this for a while. Handy, you are viewing art and having a conversation with Michael. Otherwise, you're going to do what? Your gear, you did not get that needs. You'll go for a meal before too long. Otherwise, let's continue the plan of popping in furniture. You've got the important stuff done in here. So let's get uh, Handy, this one built next. And then... They're over here somewhere. They're right down there. Then that one, and that one. This one, this one. And then you'll probably break for a meal. Okay, so we'll stop there. Um, Klaus, what you up to? You are consuming a fine meal, and you'll still need to grab a meal after that, so I won't bother you. Shantigo is cooking a fine meal after he delivers 75 meat, but not that one, and not that one. But maybe this one? Yep, you can do that one. That is so weird. But I need to do that one first. So cancel all of that and do that instead. And then need 75 of some kind of veggie. Let's grab rice, but not that rice. What do you got over here? Nothing. Can we grab that rice? We can grab that one. <laughs> no, I, I don't understand it. I just don't. <laughs> anyway... Um, yeah, there were no dogs queued up or wouldn't let me do any of them. So that's Shantigo. Rabbit, you are up in here. You are harvesting potato plants. Good. Harvest all that you can. And will this rain stop? Wow. Uh, Handy's busy. Tomislav is working on research. You gave up up here, huh? No, you got it all laid out and you built one. Okay, we'll go with that. Um, over in here, you guys are all asleep. Michael is busy rock cutting. Miss P should be ending her night soon. Did she wipe out all that? She did. And two more left to come back and get later. So I guess after this episode's over, I'll send everybody mass, uh, in mass over here to haul another big group of those back in. Um, with all of these pigs, how many pigs are hauling right now? The animals... What do we got here? A sign. There's a whole bunch of new ones. Yeah. So let's make sure everybody's doing where they're supposed to be. Raising zone. All the little guys are, except for the, the three newest ones. Put them back in there. Um, wild boar zone is all of these guys. You are still needing your hauling done, but you're in the grazing zone. Um, over here, grazing, grazing, grazing. And you three are boomalopes. So it looks like everybody's where they're supposed to be. And so I've got one, two, three, four, five, six dog haulers and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine pig haulers. And you think I can get any of this steel in? It's right over there. Yeah, there's just too many other things. Although, if they concentrate on bringing all of these in as fast as Rabbit you know, harvests them, I will be very happy. I have no problem. Are you really consuming one of the good potato plants? You are. Rabbit, you're doing what? You're viewing art. Do you really need to view art? You don't really need to view art, you know. So let's have you haul rice in, and then when you're done, the rain stopped. Ah, oh, I just realized that constant drone just ended. Yeah. <laughs> I used to get that effect if you've... Well, in, on my Patreon page, I've got a story that I wrote. Um, called a Minecraft adventure and what one, uh, one thing I remembered in there I, I played Minecraft and I wrote everything that I saw and did as if I was actually there pretty interesting story and one of the things that I noticed while I was playing it and while I was writing it was when it had been raining for a couple of days non-stop and then suddenly it stopped and everything was silent and I felt like this load of stress that was on me finally or suddenly just went away and that's what it just felt like there anyway we're at about 45 minutes and I'm not seeing this getting any more exciting soon I'm hoping when I said that that this would drop down and, and start screaming at me but it didn't 
work. You know, would have been great timing. But I think I'm going to call this one done here, and I'll do a little more micromanaging and get more materials dropped off in all the spots, and so the handy can just wander through and not do what she was asked to do. Okay, come back over here, and actually, you got all those built. You did, yeah. So I'm gonna call it done here. I'll send her through and try to get the last of all the the beds and nightstands and chairs built, and then Klaus can jump in and do all the rest of them. Maybe Tomislav as well. Otherwise, he's researching carpet making. So if we get any special requests for carpet colors, we'll go. We'll be capable of doing that. But I'm gonna call this one done. It's the Noble Rambler. I'll catch you later. Bye bye. Mm -hmm.